cumulus clouds are a familiar sight in the skies over our heads. They can grow and turn into showers or even thunderstorms. We just need the right conditions in the atmosphere, something that we call instability. But it can also be thought of as the buoyancy of the atmosphere. Now we can show you that using water at different temperatures. In this plastic beaker, we have cold water. I'm going to lower some warm water that's been dyed red in this old spice jar. And let's just see what happens. As we lower that down to the bottom, notice the red starts to rise out of that spice jar. The warmer, less dense water rising around the colder, more dense water. And that's convection in action. That's what happens in our atmosphere. The air rises and as it cools, it condenses and forms cumulus clouds. It's also what happens with thermals. When on a hot day, the ground heats up, that warms the lower part of the atmosphere and that warmer air rises because it's less dense. Those thermals that we see used by birds and gliders and even hot air balloons.